I wanted to give a little razzle dazzle, okay? But then I realized <laughs> we're not doing that today. Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by Outrade. They were kind of sending me another unit to review for you guys. Okay, now before we get into the install, the specs, and what I think about this unit straight out the pack, let me tell you right now, watch the install. Watch the video, get all the pros and cons so you know whether or not you wanna buy the unit, okay? Because if you come back and tell me what I already told you in this video, <sighs> sis. <laughs> Make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Brielin, Brielin, what's that say, huh? What's your name? Give me a call out with the pronunciation or something, I don't know. Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from Outre. It is a part of their Melted Hairline series. This is the brand new unit by the name of Brielin, Brielin, however you wanna say it, okay? I got it in the DR Chocolate Swirl color, and the unit does retail around $35, depending on the site that you get her from. This unit also comes in specialty colors, so if you wanna check those out, you can. There will be a $2 to $4 upcharge for those colors. I'm definitely seeing a new color, I think. The DR2 Cinnamon One? Is that like Sensational's Burgundy One? Cause if so, I'ma need to find her in a sleek unit. <laughs> this unit does come with HD transparent lace from ear to ear, two combs on the side, one comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. As you know, this unit does come with the elastic band, so if you are a big head gang gang like me, I advise you not to wear that joint. I do have mine on right now because I wanted to see how it was gonna fit because I've noticed that some wigs from this line fit my head and other ones don't, okay? Either way, I don't want the temples pulsating, but I still tried it on this joint. Even the cap is fitting pretty big. I had some excess here on the sides that I did have to cut off, but I can definitely feel the pressure building up around, you know, my cap because of that elastic band, so be mindful of that. If you are someone like me who likes to wear their wig grip under their unit, be mindful of how long you plan on wearing your unit and if you want to wear the elastic band with it because you lose some space wearing that wig grip. Wear the wig grip though, okay? We're still protecting the edges. This is a high tech fiber unit and it is heat safe up to about 400 degrees. I did use my blow dryer on top as well as um, my hot comb in the front because of how I wanted to style the unit initially out the box. I wanted to give a little razzle dazzle, okay? But then I realized, <laughs> We not doing that today. My wig was not cooperating with, <laughs> I just, I couldn't do it today. Mm -mm. The texture of this unit does have like a, it's not the softest hair that I felt from Outre. It does feel synthetic, but it is wearable, okay? I did get shedding and tangling with my unit. It is a long, wavy, curly type of unit. So I did kind of expect that out the gate. What I didn't expect out the gate though was something that I talked about in my last Melted Hairline um, unit, the hairline. The hairline is not as, it's not as pre-plugged as I feel like other units from this series has been. What we've come to know and love for this series is the hairline, the naturalness of it, not having to go in and do a whole bunch of work to it. However, with the last two units that I've tried from this collection, I have had to go in and pluck through the unit. She was gonna need some plucking to look how I wanted her to look. Now, if you liked how she looked at the pack and you wanted to swoop your baby hairs and do all that kind of stuff, by all means, you can do that. Do your thing, Patty. But for me and my dome, I wanted a certain look for my unit, and let's just say, she wasn't working out. <laughs> 
this is the look that this unit is given, similar to what is on her card, okay? I tried to be real extra, okay? I tried to be real extra and do like really big hair with a nice little hairline. I had to go ahead and rein her back in, okay? Because, no. <laughs> Even the knots on the hairline were a little bit thicker than I was used to. I was like, dang, do I need bleach? Don't bleach your synthetic wigs. Woo, child. Also, this is a lot of hair, okay? Y'all know I like big hair. But this right here, mm, 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 mm. The more you play in this unit, the bigger you try to make it, the more unruly this hair will get. I had to go back in with my Nairobi Wrap and Shine Foaming Mousse to get my hair back under control because how it was looking, <laughs> No, no. And I actually like how she looks on me now. After I put the mousse on the ends right here, look how that curl is looking. Like the mousse will pop the curls right back in your unit. So get the mousse. Because it definitely made my hair feel a little bit softer here on the end. It's real juicy. Like look at a little, look at a little tendril. Look at a little boop boop. <laughs> Woo, now this unit does bring the heat. If I ain't have my AC on or my fan on, I'll be sweating, okay? So be mindful of that. But you can pin this unit up into a ponytail. I did do a little ponytail right here, as you can see. And I ain't going front. That was kind of cute, okay? So if you want to rock your unit in a ponytail, you can do that, okay? If you have not seen me rock my synthetic wigs in a ponytail, whether it's a lace part unit or a lace front unit, definitely check out my ponytail playlist. I does it all over there, okay? I ain't, I ain't gonna be doing a whole bunch of moves with this unit, okay? When I move, my hair move, you hear me? Hey, we move together, okay? <laughs> My favorite part about this unit is the color. I think it looks really, really pretty. I think it's a very nice color to step into the summer. Okay, give me a little spice. The look that I'm serving now, I feel like it's a look. Okay, it's a look. I just know some things are changing. Something, Something's different. Maybe they're trying something different with the newer collections to try to give us a cheaper price point for the same unit. So I'm pretty sure these are normally around almost $40, like $37. But this one, like I said, was $34. Okay, but that's pretty much all I got for you guys today. I gave you guys some pros and some cons to think about. If you wanna check this unit out for yourself, I will put some direct links for it down below. Shout out one more time to Outre for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.